Hi everyone, this is Steve from Open Bomb. In today's video, I'd like to catch you up on where we are with Open Bomb for NetSuite. We've made quite a few improvements uh, over the last few weeks. And I believe the last video was much more of an introduction or a sneak peek. Today's video is definitely a product tour. So I built a bill of material inside Open Bomb for a pump, and I built this in SolidWorks. Of course, you can build it in uh, just about any CAD system and use the OpenBOM integration to bring it into OpenBOM. I, uh, once I got into OpenBOM, I used some of the features inside OpenBOM to add cost, compute extended cost based on quantity, and of course, to enable the totals and display the roll-up cost for my, for my bill of material. So I've finished with the engineering work on this and I'm ready to move to manufacturing. In my company, we use a NetSuite as our ERP system, and I'm ready to pull this bill material into my uh, NetSuite manufacturing bomb. So let's get started. Let's, uh, let's go to our NetSuite homepage and take a look at uh, the bill of material, bill of material area where all the fun stuff will happen. Let's create a new bill of material, and we're going to call this uh, pump demo five. Okay, let's go ahead and save that. Terrific. Let's edit. we can see that that shows up in our list. We are going to edit that. And in uh, in OpenBOM for NetSuite, we use the advanced NetSuite bill of material, which has uh, some additional functionality. One of which is the ability to create revisions. So let's go ahead and create a new revision of this and we are going to pull in our WPX 100 fill material. That is the part number for that, uh, for that pump bill material. So you'll be greeted with the uh, familiar uh, OpenBOM user interface. As a matter of fact, this is OpenBOM running directly inside of NetSuite. Uh, the next thing that uh, that we'll do is we'll take a look at the property settings. You'll be familiar with most of this and tells us which NetSuite property uh, is populated with which OpenBOM property. So there, we have quite a, quite a lot of options here. As you can see, I'm just using just a few of them. Um, but let's go ahead and update one particular one that I like to use for uh, the al alternate image. And let's go ahead and put our thumbnail image in there as well. You'll see what that does in a minute. We're also using display image here. Next thing, we will update the NetSuite manufacturing bomb. So what's going on here is the, uh, is the open bomb for NetSuite is extracting the information directly from your, uh, your bill of material in the open bomb cloud and using the map that we created and some other uh, algorithms is building the NetSuite for manufacturing bill of material. And uh, you know, picking up the structure and all the properties that we've defined and creating that uh, bomb part list. So once this uh, once this completes, we'll see we'll get a little report of the parts that were that were, were retrieved. And then we'll be able to see this in that's sweet. Okay, looks like 35 parts were pulled in for that uh, particular bill of material. Sure, again, here they are. So let's just go ahead and save this as our message. Let me take care of that. Go ahead and save that. We can see now that we have one, uh, one revision for this Pump Demo 5. So let's go ahead and take a look at that. Got our, our engineering components. We can uh, kind of drill down into some of these, take a look at more details, and you'll see this uh, in, in uh, the NetSuite behavior. We, I'm going to show you where we used some of that mapping just a second ago. I think in, uh, in our web store here, we brought the image in. There's a number of different places that we can map that data. 
as you can see that NetSuite is very robust and has a lot of different views of the data for sales and pricing and our inventories and you know, web stores and other things. So we can map that image where, you know, where it needs to go. So, so that's great. So what my guys, my guys have their bomb in NetSuite and a change comes down from engineering an ECO. Let's see how that plays out. We've updated our bill of material to, uh, to uh, include those changes and we return to NetSuite and simply add another revision and go through the, go through the same process again. And I won't go through this in the interest of time here, but we can see that we will just stack up individual revisions for this particular bill of material <clears throat> and, uh, and have them available for our manufacturing team. So um, we welcome your feedback. Uh, there's more information available online. You can always reach us at support at openbomb.com. Thank you.